Hey, this is JC here at JC's Comics and More, your pop culture superstore at 6725 West Central Avenue. That's Toledo, Ohio. 436-17419-536-531-6097, right? 419-531-6097. I've got... Couple of different things on my mind, so I'm not I'm not concentrating. I'm just sort of just on autopilot right now. But this is Tuesday night, the 12th of April, and we're getting ready to do the diamond box. And as we're getting ready to do that, just gonna show a few things here as we're getting ready to crack open that box to show some of the figures and stuff. You know, my DC figures here, but there's so many DC figures that came in this week that I did not have room to put all the DC figures here. So what I did, and we end up, oh, look at these. Here you go. There's your killer clowns from, from outer space. There's your Christopher Lee Frankenstein. There's your Toxic Avenger. Here is your... Phantom of the Opera, the Red Death. I've got to put more Frankensteins to put more Wolfmans out. Thanks to Mr. Psy, who was in here earlier and uh, spent some much, much needed and much well, well earned money. Look, we've got the creature here. There's Frankenstein. Got the mummy. We've got the wolf man. He's around here someplace too. I think he's grabbing a bite to eat. But the DC figures, I went ahead and put up front here, where usually I have the NFL figures. I've got them on top, but I put some spawn figures up front here, and we got some of the new DC figures up front here. So I'm gonna use this as a new showcase. Now, if somebody just comes in and buys these KISS figures, that'll give me some extra room. So, some KISS fan out here needs to come buy me some, buy some KISS figures. But, got the Godzilla, the big Tower of Godzilla. T big Tower of Godzilla. And old Billy, if, uh, I'd like to thank Billy for helping me out today. Uh, pick up the boxes. That was very, very much appreciated, as is... Uh, Mr. Patrick helping me with doing the um, some of the some of the leg work here, pricing figures out and getting stuff ready for me, and helping with the uh, helping with the um, oh with the uh, the diamond uh, unboxing. So we're gonna go do that right now. So let's go take care of that. And I still have got comics. I still have to process. It's a never-ending process, as they say. Okay. Put you take that there. We've got the diamond box here. I'm going to crack this open. So, you like, like old school, not how I've been doing it. Figure it's not a large box, so should be able to get it cracked open pretty, pretty quickly. Considering one side is very a very tiny side as diamond does not know how to package boxes got this book here uh, hunter's tail i can't remember why i ordered this but probably one for mr scott I'm sure we're gonna have that there we got some of these dynamic forces uh, mary jane black cat covers uh tyler with tyler kirkman or kirkham so we've got these are going to be available for sale. I bought three of those. So if you guys are interested, oh look, you get a piece of styrofoam with it too. Uh, certainly let me know in the comments below. I know of a couple of people that might be interested. I want to say the price on those are $29.99. Uh, we've got Life Zero number three. This would be the cover D. It's a takeoff on the Amazing Spider-Man 129 cover with the Punisher. Let me check. It is cover. It's actually cover C of that. Uh, lots of Sheenas this week. There's number five. This is a 
cover A. There should be more cover A's in here someplace. We've got X-Men 92. We'll just set the Marvels aside. We've already gone over them. We've got the Immortal, uh, Immortal Red Sonja number one. I forgot that was coming out. That is a variant. We've got Betty Page number two, the Alien Agenda. This is a cover D on that. Here we have, uh, gosh, what the hell? Image. Uh, this is, uh, what image book is this? This is the anniversary book. Of course, they don't, they don't make it easy, do they? Um, image, 30th anniversary anthology. Now, it's really nice if they would have actually had that on the comic. Maybe on top there. Image, you guys are too clever for your own good. My God. We've got Noctera number nine. That came in. I know Mr. Joe gets a copy of that. I think Mr. Jeff gets a copy also. You guys let me know. That's cover C on Noctera. Daisy, Daisy number five of five from Dark Horse. That's a cover A on that. There's Venom number seven. Here we have, uh, this is uh, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers number 18. That's a variant cover. North Bend from Scout Comics number four. That is, I know, for Scott. Darth Vader number 22. That's a variant. Sword of... Hyboria, number four. That's cover A. I know Mr. Joe gets one of those. So make sure I just set that aside for him right away. Star Wars 22. That's a variant on that. Here we have a Breakout from number one from Dark Horse. This is cover A on that. Uh, the, the Wrong Earth, Fame and Fortune, number one. This is for Scott. There's an extra copy for the shelf. Immortal She-Hulk. Or, I mean, Immortal, Immortal Red Sonja. See, Immortal Hulk and She-Hulk uh, all blending together. But that's a variant. Here's more of the Sheena, number five, covers. So I knew I needed to put a couple of those aside. Immortal Red Sonja, number one. That is the... E uh, cosplay cover on that. There's another Sheena number five. Lots of dynamite covers. If we're for all the dynamite covers, I'd probably only have a small box. Here we have Breakout. This is would be the cover B on that. Looking forward to reading that. I wonder if it's uh, kind of similar to the Joneses that came out last week from... Uh, AWA, which I highly recommend. Hit Me from AWA number two. That's for Scott. Sheena, Queen of the Jungle. That's cover B. I'm going to set one of those aside. I'm sure uh, I've got somebody that wants one of those. Midnight Rose from Aftershock. Jim Starlin. Uh, I know a couple of people are going to want that, so I'm going to make sure a couple of those copies get set aside. Unfortunately, Jim did not do the artwork. He just wrote it. But it should be damn good nonetheless. Here's more of those dang uh, image 30th anniversary issues that you don't know exactly what the hell they are. Sheena number five. This is a variant on that. I think this is probably like a 1 in 10 or one something like that. Wish I could have ordered more of these because I know of several guys that probably want this. Unfortunately, there's one person that is going to. Here's Immortal Red Sonja, number one. This, uh, I believe, is probably an A cover. That is a B cover. So I know of a couple copies of that that's getting set aside. Somebody was just asked, the other day asking me when that was starting up. Is this the, nope, this is um, the A cover. And again, I know of a couple of individuals that want that. And baby, I got back, for sure, Red Sonja. But she'll get her sword out and she'll, she'll cut your eyes out for looking at her that way. Electra 100, we'll just set that aside. Keiju score, number one, steal from the gods, that's for Scott. Now we do have an extra copy of that available for sale. 
So in case anybody wants it, we do have an extra copy, extra two copies in fact. <clears throat> Immortal Red Sonya 1. This is a variant on that. Set that over there. I've got, a, I've got several of these variants. So I've got several that would be available for uh, you guys. If you're interested, again, let me know. Rain. Rain number four. Really bad how they put the logo here. Uh, it should be at the top here. I'm down to one copy on that now, probably because no one can find the book because the logo is in such a crappy uh, spot. Eve Orney, issue number five. Arthur Sudan cover. This is what the B cover. This is the A cover. I've got one guy that buys Evil Ernie. I'm going to make sure at least he gets his copy, and then we'll have a copy left over. The David Mack cover on North Mythology, uh, the third volume. So we'll set those aside. We've got statistics. This, uh, this is from Jeffrey Lewis. Uh, this is number one. I know that is for Scott. I will try to read that before uh, it goes to him. Nocturna number nine. This is the a cover on that so we'll make sure copies get set aside to the individuals that are going to want that we write titans number three this is from vault that's being set aside for scott you guys got to let me know if you're interested in these books these uh, small press books i'm not buying any extra copies than what i know i can sell immediately uh life zero this is probably the d cover this is the d cover this cover is based upon uncanny x-men 173 with wolverine and rogue respectfully on that cover i love the homage covers i absolutely absolutely do Here's another Sonya or um, uh, Sheena number five variant on that. Here's a Captain Carter number two. <clears throat> Mortal Red Sonya. This is a D cover on that. I thought for sure Joe Linsner did some covers on these. Maybe we not have run into him. He's probably the C cover. G.I. Joe 40th Anniversary Special. This is for Steven. This is a takeoff cover on issue 21, the silent edition. A Town Called Terror. I'm looking forward to reading this from Image. This is the... C cover, this might be a variant, might be a, a tiered variant. Human Remains from Vault, this is number seven. This has been a very weird book. That is the A cover. We've got Mighty Morphin 18. Uh, these do not go on the stand. I've got three guys that order it, and that's all I order is three. So, again, if people want me to order these things, you've got to let me know. I don't take any unwanted risk much longer with these books. Farmhand, number 16, the only copy, going to Scott. He's a smart man. He sends me a list. Betty Page, number two, cover C. I think that's the only cover. I thought I had more covers than that. Something that was killing the children, Slaughter Pack, issue 11 through 15 on that. This is the third one that they've done now. And I'm down to just ordering two of those. The speculators have abandoned something that's killing the children. Uh, the Rush number five. This would be cover B on that. The Rush stands for, I guess, this hungry earth reddens under snow clad hills. But nobody's looking at the Rush. They're too clever for their own good. More Noctura cover C's. We've seen those already, so we'll just put those aside. Life Zero, number three. This is cover A on that. Sheena, Queen of the Jungle. This is a cosplay cover, probably cover E. Cover E. Black Panther, number five. Alex Ross cover. <clears throat> the last book you'll ever read from Vault, number seven. All Guts, No Glory from Xenoscope, issue three. That is a special order. Here's Sheena. This is a variant cover on issue five. 
Last Flight Out, number six of six from uh, Dark Horse. Here is the J. Lee cover on Immortal Red Sonia. That is cover, actually this is a uh, variant cover. Venom, the Spider-Man variant cover on Venom number seven. King Spawn number nine. They, uh, their B covers are now, this is a B cover, are now going to be primarily just uh, blank sketch covers for you to get sketches on them. Now from uh, uh, Xenoscope, Van Helsing, Shattered, Saturn Soul. This is a one shot. That is a cover A on that. So we got Mighty Morphin number 90. That's legacy number. So I've got guys that want that. Another one of those. There's a Darth Vader 22. X Men number 10. Evil Ernie. This would be cover B on issue 5. This is the last issue of the series. Immortal Red Sonia. That's a variant cover. As is this virgin copy of that. Black Panther 5, the Red, uh, Greg Land cover. Radio Spaceman number 2. I know people that are going to be excited about their Radio Spaceman. And I'm still getting around and still need to find time to read number 1. Evil Ready number 5, that's a variant cover. Electro 100. This would be cover B's, I believe. Or these cover A's. These are these are cover B's on Noctura. And battery ran out, so I just tossed a new fresh battery in there. Here's Sheena number five. This is a Lindsner cover. A little bit different. Doesn't quite look like Lindsner. I mean you've got to kind of look at it a little bit to tell. Oh yeah, that's Lindsner. And that is cover D on that. Red Helsing Shattered, Shattered Soul. This is the B cover on that. Sword of Hyboria. This would be the B cover, I believe. This is the B cover. Seven Secrets, number 16. Let's set that aside. Here's Mighty Morphin, number 18. This is another variant, a reveal variant. What's the reveal? The Pink Ranger uses a bow, I guess. But here is the Joe Lindsner Immortal Red Sonia cover. And Red Sonia is in her original Hot Pants outfit that uh, when Conan first found her before she went to the metal bikini. And that is cover C on that Red Sonia. Evor 5, this is a takeoff on uh, uh, New Mutants number 9, 90, or number 99. They actually, the artist is actually smart enough to give credit to Rob Liefeld. A lot of these artists that do these homage covers, they don't give credit where credit is due. Here is a blank cover on Immortal Red Sonia number 1. Here's Nita. Howe's Nightmare Blog. This is the uh, the Norman Rockwell variant, the cover B on that. I do believe it is the cover B. I know Mr. Jeff is going to want one, so I'll make sure one is set aside for him just right off the top. That's the Kill Lock, number two from IDW. Here is the Rush. This is the A cover. This doesn't need all that fancy what the Rush stands for. It has it here, this hungry earth. See, that's the way to do it. Not doing it all that nonsense. You guys are better than that. We got Betty Page. This is a black cover with a naughty, naughty, naughty Betty. Betty picture underneath it. Well, naughty with her goods. Betty's with her goods out. I know of a couple of people that are going to want that, so I'll make sure I set those aside. And it's resealable bags. I could certainly open it up, but uh, that would spoil the, uh, the surprise. Here, I didn't realize I had more of these statistics uh, by Jeffrey Lewis. This is probably what, Fanographics? Who is this? First printing, 4,000 copies. I'm not sure uh, who printed that. 
but I look forward to reading it. As this book here, A Town Called Terror, number one. Steve Niles, who of course did uh, 30 Days of Night. So maybe this might be a something to do with that. Uh, this is e, the A cover. And I know of several people that are going to want copies of that just because. So I'm going to make sure that those copies get set aside for them immediately. Here's another variant cover on Immortal Red Sonia, number one. Here is All Guts, No Glory, number three. This is the B cover. The B cover on that. All right, we've got Star Wars number 22. That's the A cover on Star Wars 22. We've got Sheena, Queen of the Jungle, number 5, Arthur Sudan cover. That is the C cover on Arthur Sudan. Betty Page, look, another Linster cover. We've got three, Lin or three Linster covers this week. What a glorious day. And Betty's got her swoops going on. She's got, the, got her onk. And you see the, the pyramids, they're happy. And that is a cover A on Betty Page, the alien agenda number two. Town, Town Caught Terror, this would be the B cover on that. King Spawn, number nine, that is the A cover on King Spawn. I know a couple of people are going to want that, so I'm going to make sure I set those aside. And since they're doing those blank covers now, I'm ordering more of the A covers. So uh, I might be ordering less of the A covers if the A covers now don't sell because of that. Todd is getting a little bit too clever. Todd doing the, the blank covers tells me that sales on all of his spawn books are down probably greatly. Here is... Uh, uh, North Mythology, number three. P. Craig Russell cover. Uh, so we've got those there. I'm going to make sure copies get set aside for those who want those. Angel, number four. Got two copies. Those are for a couple of customers. Here's another variant. Variant Virgin on uh, Sheena, Queen of the Jungle, number five. Nita Howe's Nightmare Blog number six. That's the A cover on that. Just in time for Easter, you got Jesus on the cross. Hallelujah. We got more Betty Page, the Alien Agendas. She's doing her best uh, Tomb Raider right there. This is the B cover on the Betty Page, the Alien Agendas. And then looks like finally we end with. Van Helsing, Shattered Soul, and this is probably what the A cover, this is the C cover, and that is where we're going to end, hope everybody has enjoyed this video, if you've not subscribed to the channel yet, please subscribe to the channel, helps it greatly, smash the bell, like, comment, share, I cannot stress enough, your comments help these videos get out there and get in circulation. And liking and sharing. So please like, share, and comment. Hope everybody has a great new comics Wednesday tomorrow. Thanks again to everybody that helped today so much. Billy, Patrick, and great talking with Sai again. Thanks again. You guys have a great afternoon or a great evening. See you tomorrow.